Let's go to 1 John 3 and 15. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. So whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer. I know that this says brother, but this is interchangeable. This is, this says brother, but this is saying brother and sister. And who are our brothers and sisters? Everyone. So, whosoever hates anyone is a murderer. So, if you hate anyone, you are the same as a murderer. This is what it is saying. I know that you may disagree with this, but this is what it is saying. Whosoever hateth his brother is a murderer brother, sister, anyone. Whosoever hates anyone is a murderer. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. So if you hate anyone, you can't go to heaven. Because the only way that you can receive eternal life is if you go to heaven. There is eternal life in heaven. If you go to hell, you are still going to be alive. Your spirit does not die. But when you go to hell, then to the lake of fire, that they don't call that life. They call that damnation, which is not a cuss word. <laughs> so don't say that I cursed. So when the Bible speaks about eternal life, they are referring to heaven. They are never speaking about, I don't think they refer hell to eternal life. Now they may say that you will be in hell for eternity, but usually when they say eternal life, they are referring to heaven. Hell, there is no life, life in hell. Of course, your spirit is going to be alive because your spirit does not die. This flesh dies, this earthly suit dies, but your spirit that is within you does not die. Does that make any sense? So when you die, your spirit is going to come out. And your spirit is either going to go to heaven or hell. And from there, if you go to hell, you are going to be tormented. Imagine being tormented and not being able to die. Insane. I can't even imagine that. Very, very insane. So this should be more of an incentive to change your life. God bless.